Hello my friends and welcome back to another video. Today we're diving back into the uncleared 0.0% .0 level series in our quest to leave no levels left uncleared in Mario Maker 2. Yet again and as always we are filtering by clear rate changing the difficulty to expert. Let's go ahead and see what uncleared levels come our way. <laughs> I think the first uncleared level we're going to check out today is simply called red as you can see by the thumbnail it is very red there's no description it's got zero clears out of almost 100 attempts let's give it a whirl all right well friends uh i'm not gonna lie so far this seems pretty dadgum awesome <laughs> seems like a really heckin good level has been bequeathed to us and uh, it makes me very happy. Very happy indeed. All right, we're up the pipe. Okay, now we're going to be swimming. Something well, Yes, there is. Nice, we still have our power up, so that's really cool. Okay, so the lava is actually lowering. Wasn't... Okay, that was, that was just silly on my part, getting close to a track like that. But hopefully... Okay, there's a door right there. So hopefully there's another power up or something. Okay, just wait. Look at me. Look at me turning over a new leaf. Not trying to fly through levels. Just taking my time. Good things happen. When you take your time. No, sometimes. That was uh, pretty lucky. <laughs> I was quite literally insane. Okay, so we're back. Hopefully there's a checkpoint or something. No checkpoint. Checkpoint. But there is a safe spot right here. Safe spot right here, I think. Yeah, okay. No. Well, we're already near the end of the level. Okay. Nothing silly now. Wait a second. Is there a safe spot still? I'm not mad, I'm just disappointed. We... <laughs> we were so close, man. Oh, that's just unfortunate. Just unfortunate. But, you know, you live and you learn, and... We do it again. My hope is that this is a pro progressive power-up, and I... I, how, I literally lost it. Oh, that's... Right at the heckin' end. I was gonna say, I hope this is a progressive power-up. Two seconds before it would have been a progressive power-up. Oh my gosh, we're gonna be doing the same. Well, we're going into the, the ending in the same exact shape as we were. Oh, it's actually scared me. At least I know I'm alive. Literally all we gotta do is get a power-up to that room and I think we can damage boost our way to, to victory. This is again yet another level that I, I don't understand why there's not a checkpoint. Like it's a really, really good level, man. And I'm not saying it's overly long, but it could take this level from being good to like great just with a, a checkpoint. It is a progressive power up. Nice, okay. This is big time. We got this progressive power up. Call me Flo because this is progressive. That was terrible. I lost it, man. I can't, I can't, I, I mean, I can believe it. I absolutely. <laughs> this is just comical. <laughs> Had a fire flower and I choked it. Oh my gosh, my... This time for sure, baby. This time for sure, we're gonna take... Yes! Yes! Heckin' right, okay. We might be even just able to damage boost to the end. I'm not going, I'm not gonna try to. If we get to the middle layer, we absolutely can damage boost.
Yes! Yes! Fun level, man. Very, very fun. Wasn't super fond of, you know, a few minor parts, but overall, it's a really well put together level. You can tell the creator put a lot of time and effort into it. Like I said, my complaint of no checkpoint, you know, I, I wish more levels used it, but it was still a really good level. And it's always terrifying when you play a good level first in this uncleared level series, because things can only go... Let's check out this P-Switch times 40 Japanese level. It has zero clears out of... I don't know how many. But as P-Daddy, we gotta beat 40 P-Switches. I don't know if it said all P-Switches. Biggest thing we have to be careful with is... It's very easy to grab the P. Ha <laughs> ha! Wow, that really ramps up right there at the end. This level really lulls you into a false sense of... See, that, there I grabbed the P. That's what I didn't want to do. But yeah, this level lulls you into a false sense of security. Like, okay, these are, this isn't a bad, too bad. And then the last couple P switches that you have to jump on are exceptionally tough. Here we go. I'm gonna do things a little bit. Got it. Did things a little bit backwards there, so it made the final jump a little bit. I really don't think I made that easier. I probably made it harder, but alas, we still did it. The title of P Daddy reigns supreme. First clear, let's go. Another Japanese level. This thumbnail has my attention. It looks like it's like a baseball mini game, which would be really heckin' cool if that's what it is. So let's check it out and see what we got. Is that what that's... Okay, maybe... Tanuki Tail. I think I already failed. So this is kind of like a pitcher. This is really neat. Tis the season for baseball, friends. Let me, uh, actually, let me move my webcam here so it's a little bit easier to see. Got it, okay. Yes, it's basically like, oh, ha, ha, ha. That's like a, I don't even know what kind of pitch that would be. It starts off slow and gets faster. That would be deadly if that was a, actually able to be thrown. If modern physics allowed that. Actually, what I should do here, uh-oh. That's, that's a little bit smarter. Now we have an extra hit. Basically, we have two strikes instead of one strike to hit this. But uh, I used to be a huge baseball fan. Shout out to the Pittsburgh Pirates for being terrible. Technically, this isn't a soft lock. If I was good, I might be able to lose my show. I'm not good. So this is just a nice soft lock. Beautiful! I don't know, what exactly am I supposed to? Oh, I guess that works. I'm gonna go really slow, and then go really fast. <laughs> that was awesome! Okay, alright, alright, try it again. This is so cool! Except when it breaks. <laughs> when it breaks, it's not it's not quite as cool when when the level breaks. But it's still a really cool concept that I'm digging. Like that's just really unfortunate. It, if you're just a fraction off, it breaks it, and then soft lock city. This is as far as we've made. No. Yes. Oh my gosh. Alright, this is gonna be insane. Look at that glass conveyor. Yes. Did we do it? Heckin' right, did we do it? Very, very cool concept. Little bit janky. The the level breaks at a few points where you get soft locked. 
But overall, I really, really like the concept of it. Would love to see more of that and uh, maybe a little fine tuning as well. Next up, let's check out Kaizo Speedrun by ZDog IRL. Hopefully, this one will. You know, not all Kaizo's created equally. Pretty neat so far. Indicators have been pretty spot on. Oh, gotta do a... Is that a shell jump there? I think you have to do a shell jump there. Okay, well, now we know. There we go. I guess, am I supposed to hold, I guess I'm supposed to hold jump at the wiggler part, maybe? All right, that's good. Okay, here we go, let's try it again. Definitely not holding jump there. There we go. Cool. Cool. Um, yeah, if your spacing's off just a little bit, the wiggler part doesn't seem to work. But overall, really cool. Really fun. And happy to have the first clue. Oh, you know, we've played too many good levels in this episode. I think, I think it's time we play the hardest level you've ever played. We'll see. We'll see. We'll give it a try anyways. About time we play some hot doo-doo. I've, I've had my fun. Hot doo doo time. Okay. Starting off with a skull coaster. Already don't love that. I gotta say, so far, this is not the hardest level I've ever played, but it sure is up there on. Potentially the most annoying levels I've played. <laughs> what really stinks about this is that if I would die. If you die, just like I showed you there, uh, you have to redo this from the start. Always check for hidden shenanigans, friends. This makes the level a lot. First of all, I'm not going to say it makes it more fun, but it definitely makes it a lot more palatable. I'll tell you that for free. Just going for it. Well, I missed it. Okay. All right, well, now we know for next time. A little bit. A little bit more each time. And, like, this is definitely not the hardest level I've played, but... Ooh, is it dumb? Woohoo! It's a level. I don't... <laughs> okay. Good to know, good to know, good to know. Wait for the P-switch time to run out. Guess we're going back, so we need some form of power up here. There's the power up. Is this broke? Is this some form of Uno Mas where Bowser Jr. never? Now, the nice thing is we don't even need, we kind of cheese this a little bit. We don't even need to go fight Bowser Jr. We can just kind of skip that boss fight entirely. No, 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 okay. 
making an addendum. Not the hardest level you've ever played. Not the most annoying level you've played. The worst level you've played! Random Kaizo blocks underneath there, okay. <laughs> this level, man, it just keeps... It keeps surprising, and, and not in the way you want it to surprise you. Okay, we're back here. I think I got more cheese planned here. What we're gonna do, hopefully, is keep our power-up. That really stings. Actually, no. I hate it so much! I don't like it! I told you, friends, I had played too many good levels. <laughs> it was time to play our fair share of bad levels, and... I think we- I think we pulled it off. Let's try this again, shall we? Okay, so we got the key. Oh, heck me. I just soft locked myself. <laughs> I found a- Oh! Whoa! Yes! Did we do it? Is the dream alive? The dream may be alive. Huh? My wife just brought me lunch. Shout outs to Amanda DGR. Go follow her on Twitch. She's amazing. She just made me lunch and I love her so much. Oh, so good. These are so good. Like, my bad mood instantly evaporated. It's gone. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm happy to be here. <laughs> like, I am so happy right now. It's amazing what good food does for your mood. Right now, man, I got egg rolls. I can't be mad. I got egg rolls, dude. Ah, well, we gotta do it the normal way again. Love that. Love this level, man. The more I play it, the more I just love it. Wish there was a way we didn't have to take damage here, but alas, you do. Dude, that... Okay, well, I... Just so bad. It's just so... So bad. Alright, let's just go for the cheese now. I'm not even gonna go for the key. Heck, the bonus key cheese idea. I just wanna... I just wanna get a flipping power up, man. Oh, we got so lucky there. So insanely lucky. Okay, where's the... Okay, well, we are somehow in a clown Koopa car, clown... Yeah, if we had had a key, we could have skipped all of this, man. A key that... So, if you want to go for the world record on this level, the key to doing it is 100% doing the Bowser Jr. cheese strat. Otherwise, you have to fight Bowser here. Which is doable, but is a pain as well. Definitely would be a lot quicker to just fight Bowser Jr. Be on your merry way. In through the P-Door. Haha, <laughs> Bowser, what are you gonna do about it, brah? 
Well, I... Tit for tat there. He hurt me, but I also hurt him. All right, yeah, that was, um... That was really bad. I'm sorry. That's, in recent memory, that's one of the, the, the worser. Yeah, not the hardest level I've played. That's the worst of Enjoy your boot. Picked up another Japanese one on the Gambit. This one's called POW. That's all I can read. But I can read POW. Reach the goal after activating at least 126 red POW blocks. Haha, <laughs> this is cool. Actually, really heckin' cool. This is so neat! <laughs> well, there goes our ride. And also, I don't think we're supposed to have a key. I don't think we want a key. It's absurd how many good levels we've played today. It almost feels like this is a big old practical joke. You know what I mean? Like, it feels like I should not be playing this many good levels in an unclear levels episode. Okay, so... I'm probably dead! Yeah. Gotta make sure... Okay, so it's right through the first one, left through the second one. Okay, hold right through this door, and then we're gonna hold left through the next door. Still don't have enough pals yet. Dude, that was such a cool level. That was so cool. And we had just enough pals too. I just noticed that. Just enough. Amazing. Super, super pumped to get that first clear as well. There you have it, my friends. That's another Uncleared Levels episode wrapped up. And in the books, we got several more off the Uncleared board. And yeah, this was a lot of fun. We played a lot of really good levels. Some, you know, kind of mediocre ones. One, a real big stinker. But overall, really fun episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an incredible rest of your day. And until next time, take care.